Here are a few pointers on how to make the most of your Kanban tool board. You can decide the shape of the board for yourself. Whenever you feel that more columns are needed or that they need to proceed in a different order, just edit the workflow in here. To invite colleagues to your board, go back to the dashboard and use the Share option. Once this is done, you will be able to assign tasks to others. To increase your ability to focus, you can collapse the areas of your board that need no attention at the moment. Just click them, like so, and click again to reopen. To have a small board take up more space on your screen, simply zoom in with Control Plus keys. And to view an entire large board without scrolling, zoom out with Control Minus. Don't like the white background? Feel free to go dark with custom theme. Or for a clean minimalist look, try light theme. Own background images are also supported. To quickly locate a specific task, start typing its name in filters or use the built-in filtering options. These affect the current board view. If you're looking for a task across many different boards, use the search option here. To make a comment on a task, open it and use the red chat-like icon on the right. You can also direct that comment at a colleague so that they get an email notification about it. To present more information on closed cards, enable Task Summary in Board Settings and select what additional data is to be shown on tasks. And while you're in Settings, check out other power-ups, postponed and recurring tasks, card covers, and checklist templates in particular can make a difference to your workday. Make sure to also download Kanban Tool mobile app for your Android or iOS device in order to view and update your work on the go. If you do not have a Kanban board yet, feel free to create one now at kanbantool.com.